Riverboats used to travel in the North Saskatchewan River from the 1800s up until the 1920s. They used to move supplies such as lumber, as well as move large items of furniture such as pianos. Over time, riverboats evolved to be used as a way for people to travel from place to place along the river. One of the largest riverboats was the Marquis, named after Canada's Governor General at the time, Marquis Delorne. The Marquis was used by the Hudson's Bay Trading Company and could hold up to 85 passengers at a time. Alas, the Marquis was beached in 1890 and no longer used. Following this, citizens came down to the riverbank and stripped pieces off the ship as mementos. Another notable riverboat that traveled along the North Saskatchewan River was the Northcote. This riverboat was used by the Northwest Mounted Police during the Northwest Resistance, which is recognized as the only naval battle to take place on the prairies. The Northcote was carrying supplies and relief troops to Batoche before it was stopped by the Métis, who strung a ferry cable across the river, which toppled the smokestacks, rendering the boat useless for battle. However, the boat did make it to Batoche and was later used as a transport vessel. When the boats were docked in Prince Albert, parties and gatherings would be held on them. In order to accommodate for the size of these large boats, the train bridge had a center span that would open up. In 1919, the last riverboats crossed the river, and this was also the last time that the center span opened. Here at the museum, we have a replica of the Marquis, which was made by Willard Goodfellow and completed by Lauren Haverstock. To learn more about riverboats and to see the remaining pieces that have stood the test of time, visit the Prince Albert Historical Museum open 9 to 5, 7 days a week.